if you are stuck in some sort of um, massive anxious experience you've gotten maybe out of the experience but the aftermath is still there you're self-sabotaging maybe procrastinating and most of all you just can't get motivated to stay on track and you know something is holding you back this video is for you in this video I'm going to give you the three top things that are holding you back keeping you stuck number one you your thoughts you your words and number three, your actions. When we are emotionally tied to the past, it keeps us stuck. Healing emotionally is a journey that is one with support. DM the word anxiety to work with me. Getting back on track can be fast when you have support. Why is support the number one thing you need as you get back on track? Because you have someone who can lean on, someone who has expertise, someone who has helped others overcome this, and someone who can customize your solution. Here's some great news that you might not know about. Did you know that when you're stuck, you already have the solution inside you? You just have to find it. And you have, you have an idea that that is true, because you keep trying different things. And often what people do is they only address the symptoms, what it feels like to be stuck, what it feels like to procrastinate, what it feels like to have imposter syndrome, not really feeling like you deserve good things, or if you get help that it's not as valuable as figuring everything else out on your own. And this creates massive anxiety and self-sabotaging. It just is a snowball that builds up when you have loads of negative beliefs about what is possible for you, that can limit your life. So as you're watching this and you're saying, yeah, I have that, start a journal, start writing down those negative emotions, those negative feelings that you feel and the limiting beliefs that you have. There, there's no judgment, there's no shame, there's no guilt, just write them down. We all can have the negative voice that says, that we're not good enough. But when we start internalizing it and really believing it, that's when we get stuck. Start writing down the things in the past that's, that created these limiting beliefs about what's possible for you, where other people can achieve things and have peace, but for some reason you don't believe you can. Be well, my friend. 